everyone, welcome back to Dark Romance Vampire in Love. I am Bubonic Zombie, and we're here with Enron, the son of Dracula, and we are about to enter his father's castle, and he says he hasn't been there for many years because he renounced uh, his vampire heritage because he wanted to live amongst humans, and he fell in love with Emily here. So, let's go. Hall in the castle. In this room, I spoke to my father for the last time. He was incredibly mad at me that time. Ooh. Okay. What is that little puffy puff? Okay. Well, is there anything else I need to look at? Oh. Something is missing here. I have to find out what exactly. Okay. Let's go back to the hall. There's this door. Bird is missing a wing. I have to find out what's open this door. There we go. And I got a string. Yep, a core. But I'm gonna click on this. Shadow. One of the signs by which you can identify a vampire is the lack of a shadow. Really? Okay. Maybe someone else knows something I don't. Okay. Let's see. It's a portrait up there. And oh. To find the missing part in order to open this door. Okay, it looks like we don't have the missing part. We have some puzzle pieces, but not for this puzzle. Okay. Let's see. What's in the journal? Ah, he hasn't updated it. Looks like Emily is more keen to writing in her journal. Here's another piece. Let's go down in the basement. I remember how I lived here with my father. What horrible things were done. Okay. So this is that is a body. Ah. Part of the gate. Now outside. There's some more garlic. Find a zipper to open this wallet. Okay, we don't have a zipper. Judging from the clothing, they torture a lot of people here. Poor things, but I hope they avoided the worst part. Is the worst part getting turned or getting bitten? What is this? Ooh. In order to open this hiding place, I need the missing part. We have that missing part. Okay. Let's see. Oh, so that's why I call them arrows. They were literally arrows. Okay. Made the correct drawing out of these strips in order to open the trap door. You can move the sliders with the buttons on the side of the puzzle or drag the strips yourself in the correct direction. Okay. There's another piece. Is another piece gonna move when I move it? No, it's not. Okay. Some of these puzzles, you can probably you guys can probably tell, some of them are like, um you know, they, they change the difficulty every so often. And that's what that's what keeps things keeps things dynamic because you don't want everything to be super challenging right there okay and last part we need is this it yes okay okay that is an eyeball that Red hot, but not touch it with bare hands. Okay. Okay, let's see. Another hidden. Oh, found the blood. Piece is missing. You need a rose? Okay. Doors open, but I'm gonna look in the hitting object 
see what this is. Gargoyle, sun, snake, red ball, dice, torch, goblet, whip, poison, beads, quails, egg, and a dragonfly. There's a dice. Okay, there's a torch. We got the gargoyle. Okay. We still need to find a zipper for that. We have a secret passage. Anything else here? Okay, we have that. Let's get back to that gate. No, wait. Secret passage. Let's go. Keep going forward. Smoke. Old and experienced vampires possess the ability to turn into smoke. This enables them to penetrate into closed buildings and are, that are seemingly inaccessible. You know who else was able to do that? Zeus. Okay. Oh. So we have some pincers and we need several gears. Okay. Looks like we can grab that hot rod. Missing cannonballs who want to open this place within the rock. So my father has not lived here for a long time, otherwise he wouldn't let those roots break up the walls so much. It's probably a sign he's not here. So behind this crack. You need to think of how to break this wall. Okay. This is why we need the gargoyles. Okay. So let's go back to the gate. Well, let's get this first. Okay, found a rod. Okay. Let's get back to the gate. Oh, hit an object spot. Okay. Let's see, vase, fan, piggy bank, pick, acorn, mousetrap, bone, bow, arrow. The mousetrap is actually right there. Chest piece, feather duster, and a candle. There's the candle. Feather duster. Oh, there we go. We found the pick. So we can break down the wall with that. Not that. Go to the basement. Secret passage. Go to the wall. Can we use the pick? Yep. What is. Oh! Okay. We have a gym. Still need to go to the gate. Got distracted by the pick and the wall. Um, get stick. Lower the necessary pins in order to open this lock. If you push a pin in an incorrect sequence, the game will start over from the beginning. Okay. Okay. Let's pretty much try and try again. Gate is open, and now I can go into the garden. In the garden to the shed. Okay. Oh, isn't this lovely? <laughs> There's something in the hole. But that sometimes this hollow can be used as a means of communication if you find the right magic mirror. While I always had a passion for roses, perhaps because they can prick so painfully as well. Okay. 
half the gym. Place the stones so that the number of flower petals minus the number of stone facets are equal to three in order to solve this puzzle and open the door. Okay. Let's see. This is going to take some time. There we go. Door to the pantry is open. See what's stored in there. We will see what's in there in the next episode. I will see you guys later when I get back to this. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.